I'm hoping to achieve more inclusivity and diversity. I think it's just so important in this world, especially right now, with social media and so many aspects that really, really do play a part. And, you know, even for me in school, I felt so left out, isolated, because there wasn't that opportunity where my friends could learn BSL with me. It kind of felt a bit, oh, OK, I feel alone in this situation, but now it's going to make so many more children feel more included and just feel not so isolated, and that's so important to have that, in the, you know, especially... Deaf children also fall behind in school as well, purely because teachers like look away and I don't really know BSL that well. So it goes to show that actually this is really, really, really needed for these children. As a society, everybody kind of learns more mm. all the time, um, and yeah. I think you know you, you've been, been a huge part of that. But now mm. having a, a GCSE, I, and we were talking about speech and language therapists, mm -hmm. right? So that was something super important to you yeah. when you were young and we need many more speech and language therapists, so this could also be a part of someone's career journey as well. Yeah, 100%. I think, you know, one little change is also going to bring so many more aspects into it, like you said, like speech therapy, and there's not many speech therapists out there, and I was very, very lucky and fortunate enough to have one back then, and like you said, it's all about making that change, and I'm excited to see, you know, what will happen from now. Many more people with British yeah. Sign Language, I guess. Yeah, absolutely. I wish I had um, a GCSE BSL course in school 100%. I think it would have massively benefited me, especially because I had a cochlear implant. I had to learn speech therapy, so I had to move away from BSL. But I feel like if that was still there for me, I still would have continued my BSL. And for my friends as well to also learn it. And it was hard because I feel like back then it just wasn't that opportunity for me. It wasn't that opportunity for anybody. I was the only deaf student in my school. But even though if it's just one person, that one person should always feel included.